Hi there, this is Thomas Eugene Shussler III, and today I've got a Mew VMAX League Battle Deck we're going to open up. I am not all that familiar with Pokemon. I do have some Pokemon cards. I'm going to try to start start doing some other card games on here besides uh, Magic. I've only got so much money and time though, man. What, what we got here? It came with this. What, what do you What do you do? Welcome to League Battle Decks. Okay. What do you got to say, guy? Okay, so it's just explaining the uh, the deck. Okay. That's okay. We're not here for that. Look at that cute little me right there, man. All right. My knowledge of Pokemon is fairly limited. I always liked Mewtwo. I know he's the, the big bad one. What do we got in this? We got we got our VMAX Mew right here. Let's How do I get to him? It's it's set up kind of funky, man. I clip my nails all the, like really short all the time, so it's gonna be a pain in the ass to get to these. There we go. You gotta kinda of pop it like that, okay. The cat's out here bitching at me. That's pretty cool. It's all the texture on that's kinda of neat. So you get a Mew uh Mu V Max. You get two of them. Mu V Max evolves from Mu V. Okay, and here's our Mu V over here. So we got two of them. We got two of these Mu Mu Vs and Mu V Maxes, and then you get a Genesect V. He's got Fusion Strike system. He's got 190 health. He's a metal. And his ability, once during your turn, you may draw cards until you have as many cards in your hand as you have Fusion Strike Pokemon in play. Okay. In your hand is, oh, okay. His Techno Blast does 210 damage. Jesus. Cost, uh, he needs two metal and any other energy on him. During your next turn, this Pokemon can attack. So he can attack for 210, but then he can't attack next turn. Okay. He's resistant to wind, but he's weak to fire. And he's a two retreater, man. Okay. And our Mew here has got 180 health. He's a psychic. And he's got energy mix for one psychic energy. Search your deck for an energy card. Attach it to one of your fusion strike Pokemon. Then shuffle your deck. Well, that's pretty fucking cool. And then you got Psychic and uh, any other type. Psychic Leap. 70 damage. You may shuffle this Pokemon and all attached cards into your deck. Ooh. So if he's about to die, you can just put him right back in your deck. That's pretty fucked up, dude. That's pretty cool. I like that one. That's a pretty neat ability there, dude. And then we got these spiffy... Look at, look at the... They're like all special, man. Then the, the VMAX Mew. It's got 310 health. I didn't even notice that when I first grabbed the box. I just I just grabbed the box, man. He's got Gross Fusion Strike. It's two of any color. Choose one of your benched po uh, Fusion Strike Pokemon's attacks and use it as this attack. Oh, that's fucked up. And two Psychic Max Miracle does 130 damage. This attacks... Uh, this attack's damage isn't affected by any effects on your opponent's active Pokemon. Ooh, so it's going to bypass the weaknesses and everything. Uh, resistance minus 30 to phys uh, to fighter, but it's weak to dark energy. It, it can't retreat at all, dude. There's no... Oh, no, it retreats for free? That means it retreats for free, right? Holy shit, so does this Mew. It's got no retreat cost. Holy shit, that's fucked up. That's kind of, that's messed up, dude. He's a super powerful guy, and he doesn't even have a retreat cost. Holy shit. And then we got the, oh, it's just another Genesect V. It's not a VMAX. Okay, he doesn't get a VMAX. So we only got the VMAX of the Mew. Okay. And then you got some dice here. That's a cool one right there. I like that. That's a nice, cool, clear dice right there, dude. I don't, I don't care about those other ones with the 50s and stuff. These are pretty cool. Look at these tokens, dude. I don't like the other side so much, but that's that's pretty sweet, dude. That's sick right there. Yeah, so I you got one really cool dice right there and these these two pretty spiffy tokens right there. That's pretty cool. What do we got here? Some sort of code? I don't know what the code goes to. Pokemon.com redeem. 
Anyway, go, go redeem the code, people. It's your code. Go do what you want with it. First come, first serve. You can have the code, man. And here's our, our League Battle Deck box. So this is an actual ready-to-go deck, man. So it's going to be Psychic, obviously. So it's just plain Psychic. No other colors. Okay. Fusion Strike Energy. What the fuck? It's like a rainbow, dude. Special Energy. Fusion Strike. This card can only be attached to a Fusion Strike Pokemon. If this card is attached to anything other than a Fusion Strike Pokemon, discard this card. As long as this card is attached to a Pokemon, it provides every type of energy, but provides only one energy at a time. Prevent all effects of your opponent's Pokemon's abilities done to the Pokemon this card is attached to. Holy shit, so it's like any fucking mana you want. That's pretty cool. Elysia Sparkle. This is a su tr uh, supporter. Choose up to two of your Fusion Strike Pokemon for each of the uh, those Pokemon. Search your deck for a Fusion Strike Energy card and attach it to that Pokemon. Then shuffle your deck. Ooh. You can only play one supporter a turn, obviously. Fog Crystal. It's an item. Search your deck for a Psychic Energy card or a basic Psychic Energy, uh, Psychic Pokemon. Reveal it, put it into your hand, then shuffle your deck. You can play as many items as you want to turn. Bosses Orders, Cyrus. Switch one of your opponent's benched Pokemon with their active Pokemon. I like that type of thing, dude. That's pretty fucked up. That's a good one to have when they're pulling bullshit on you, like putting your guy to sleep or something. Choice Bell. The attacks of the Pokemon this card is attached to do 30 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon V before applying weaknesses and resistance. Okay. Uh, Meloetta. It's got 90 health. It's a psychic Pokemon. Melodicious Echo. It costs a psychic and one of any color. 70 times. This attack does 70 damage for each Fusion Strike energy attached to all of your Pokemon. Well, that's pretty cool for all of them, dude. It's weak to dark, resistant to fighter, and it retreats for one energy. Power Tablet. During uh, this turn, your Fusion Strike Pokemon's attacks do 30 more damage to your opponents. Activate uh, active Pokemon. Okay. Just does more damage. Okay, it's an item. Ultra Ball. You can use this card only if you discard two other cards from your hand. Search your deck for a Pokemon, reveal it, and put it into your hand. Then shuffle your deck. Okay. Battle VIP Pass. That looks pretty cool. You can use this card only during your first turn. Oh, that sucks. Search your deck for up to two basic Pokemon and put them onto your bench. Then shuffle your deck. That's damn good, but you have to get it your first turn, dude. That's pretty cool. That's a neat little gamble right there. Switch. Switch your active Pokemon with one of your benched Pokemon. Okay. I always thought when you switched your Pokemon out, like when you did the retreat and put somebody else on the field, they couldn't attack the first turn they came out. No, they can attack, man. Okay, switch your... Oh, yeah, we already did that one. Old Cemetery. That looks cool. I like that one, dude. I like it just because it looks cool. Whenever any player attaches an energy card from their hand to one of their non-psychic Pokemon, put two damage counters on that Pokemon. That is fucked up, dude. You automatically do 20 damage just because they want to attach an energy to them? That's, that's fucking garbage, dude. <laughs> Ultra Ball. You can use this card only if you discard two other cards from your hand. Search your deck for a Pokemon, reveal it, and put it into your hand. Then shuffle. Deoxys. It's a 120 health psychic Pokemon. For three of any energy, you do pho Photon Boost. It's 80 plus. If this Pokemon has any Fusion Strike energy attached... This attack does 80 more damage, so it can be up to 160. Jesus. Weak to dark, uh, resistant to fighter damage. And it retreats for one. I'm guessing uh, the resistant to fighter and weak to dark is pretty common. Hey, there's another battle VIP pass. So it's, there's two of those in here. How many of those are in here? You can have up to four. I don't see a lot of psychic energy. I've not seen a lot of psychic energy, man. Three? You only got three basic psychic energy? I mean, they've got a lot of these special energies in here, but not a whole lot, man. Hold on, where's, where's all of our energy, man? 
I'm going to make a pile of all of our energy cards, dude. There's an energy. There's a basic energy. All right. So, so far, there's only two. Holy shit, dude. That's not good. Cramomatic. You can use this card only if you discard another item card from your hand. Flip a coin. If hell, uh, if heads, search your deck for a card and put it into your hand. Then shuffle your deck. Okay. Double turbo energy. That sounds cool. It's two energy. As long as this card is attached to a Pokemon, it provides two colorless energy. This attack, uh, the attacks of Pokemon this card is attached to do 20 less damage to your opponent's Pokemon. Oh, that sucks. That's kind of lame, guy. I'm moving on off the side. There we go. Uh, we got another Alicia Sparkle, another boss's order. So there's going to be a lot of multi multiple prints of cards in here. They put in a, a fire Pokemon in this, dude. What the fuck? I haven't even seen any fire energy. They put a fire guy in here. There's no fire energy. What the fuck? Lesson in zeal. Okay, so it's got nine. It's a 90 health fire energy guy. It's a Ori Kori, Corio. Okay. All of your fusion strike Pokemon take 20 less damage from attacks from your opponent's Pokemon after applying weaknesses and resistance. You can't apply more than one lesson in zeal ability at a time. Okay. And is it? It's got, its attack is glistening droplets for a fire and a colorless. So you, you'd have to use this thing over here, the fusion energy for the uh, fire. Put five damage counters on your opponent's Pokemon in any way you like. Oh, okay. So you just disperse it between the bench. Okay, I see. It's weak to water. It's not resistance to anything. And it's got a one retreat co uh, cost. Chromomatic, fog crystal... There's another Deoxys. There's another Double Turbo Energy. There's another Power Tablet. Another Fusion Strike Energy. Another Ultra Ball. Another Melietta. Another Chromomatic Escape Rope. Each player switches their active Pokemon with one of their benched Pokemon. Your opponent switches first. Another Power Tablet. Another Escape Rope. Battle VIP Pass. Old Cemetery. Switch. Another Psychic Energy. Choice Belt, Fog Crystal, Fusion Strike. So now we're just doing multiples of all these. Double Turbo Energy. Cramomatic, Choice Belt, Meliata, Fusion Strike. Okay. Yeah, we're going through all these all over again. Okay, there we go. All right. Well, there's some cool stuff in here. I particularly, I think my favorite card that I've seen other than the, the Muse. The Muse, the Muse, a bad fucker, dude. Uh, where'd it go? Where, where is it? This old cemetery is fucking perfect for a uh, psychic deck, dude. If you're doing psychic Pokemon, that, that's fucking just spiffy right there, dude. But I don't know, dude. I don't know what I think about this deck. We've only got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We've got eleven energy in this deck, and four, only four of it's the basic psychic, man. And we got a fire guy in here, and we got no basic fire energy, so. Not so sure what to make of that deck, dude, but uh, there you go. There's the deck for you. So a lot of multi-prints, but there, uh, there's some good stuff in there. Uh, I forgot how much this costs, dude. I think it was like 30 bucks, I think. Don't quote me on that, but I think it was like 30 bucks. But this, I think it's worth it just for the, uh, that is a cool energy right there. The fusion strike energies you get. You get four of them, don't you? Yeah, you get four of these Fusion Strike energies and a couple of these old cemeteries, and then you get two of your fucking Mews right here. Your V-Mew and your v uh, Mew V-Max, man. And this this guy's a bad son of a bitch, dude. So yeah, for 30 bucks, if it was 30 bucks, I'm pretty confident it was somewhere between 20 and 30 bucks, dude. But for 30 bucks, eh, not a bad deal. Um... I don't think I'd personally use this deck. There's only 11 energy in it, but there is there is stuff I'm going to take out and throw in a deck. I got to rebuild my deck. It's not it's not very good. I don't play a lot of Pokemon. I've only got the one Pokemon deck. My nephews are starting to get into it, so I'm probably gonna I'm probably gonna be doing more Pokemon on here because my nephews are starting to get into Pokemon really really big. So, uh, but yeah, this guy right here was really sweet. So there you go. That's what you have. That's your uh, that's your Mew League Battle deck right there. So that's all what comes in it. You get your uh, deck there, your cool muse, your uh, 
Old Cemetery, your Fusion Strike Energies, and a couple cool tokens, and you got that, that one really cool dice in there, and then your regular dice right there. So that's going to do it. So that's what's inside the, the deck. So thanks for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed. I guess I'll see you next time.